Hi everybody, I am Brian Mullins the Fox. This video will not be an angry drama rant, but more of an update or typical take of sorts when it comes to this situation surrounding Kazwar Fox and his Fox Mafia spurging out, melting down all the goddamn time, and just the overall fallout from this whole drama. After Lyo Convoy's first video, I'm also taking into consideration his addendum. And I know that Lyo Convoy is putting a bunch of idiots, including Frisky, in her place on Twitter long before this video is being recorded. So, I'm not focused on Frisky at this point. She's likely getting more grilled on Twitter than I can ever hope to. So I'm going to fuck off away from that. I'm going to leave the rest for Tom in the Senate. I only came to defend them against false accusations like what Vash Lancet failed to prove voluntarily. She gets what she deserved for embodying the type of person she was the victim of. I let her dig her own grave and bury herself underneath, proverbially of course. I'm going to give you all some updates about the specific fallout. Number one, Gilded Pooh, or also known as Vlad, tries to backpedal himself being braggadocious about having terabytes of zoophilic and scat content by saying that he meant to say several hundred megabytes or something like that. But whether or not whatever he's bragging about is accurate or exaggerated is completely irrelevant. Because having that shit on your computer to quote unquote trigger f is bad in general, even if it's not illegal in your area. Two, Tom just made an addendum like I mentioned earlier in this video, also considering the fact that Case Gay is not into the baby diaper fetish, and that it was just something taken out of context. But the way I worded that part of my first video digging into the fallout of this drama surrounding Lyle Convoy's video about Kaz and his degenerate Fox Mafia is somehow neutral. Because concerning yourself with something doesn't necessarily mean that you're into it directly. It was an either or. 3. Lyle Convoy is planning to make another video as a part 2 to his initial video that caused the fallout I covered previously. By the way, by the time this video comes out, I'm still waiting for that part 2, Tom. Whenever you put that out, let me know when it's uploaded. 4. A good portion of the Fox Mafia are ditching cast to basically abandon ship and looking forward to start anew with people they considered friends. Maybe down the line, more and more of them come out against this degenerate predator hunter LARPer and his Fox Mafia. 5. Frisky Doodle, like I said before, is getting verbally and egotistically railed on Twitter by Tom in the Senate and other people. And as a quick side note rant, if Frisky dares to respond to me, Unironically, after being destroyed on Twitter, here's my advice to anyone talking to these decrepit quote-unquote victims like her, who become pieces of shit. It's just let her not just wallow in her own shit, but let her ego's corpse swim in it. And long may her ego's corpse rot. She's not worth anybody else's time, let alone mine. Just like I said in the previous Drama Rants video. 6. Falconic Chaos, or also known as Bloodlord, humiliates himself in a Star Shadow tier White Knight video, or probably worse than that in quality than Gilded Pooh's conspiratorial smearing spree. Yeah, the one about Tom and Peaches being okay with being pedo shielders, which is false beyond recognition. The only attention I'll ever give him is only to take the piss. Also, if you don't better yourself, this will scar you for life, Freddy. And Bloodlord made a diss track on Lucid Creator that's actually fucking cringe. Not to mention, he tried to false copyright strike him. And it's failing epically, cause it has not been taken down since. His response video alongside with Keisuke watching by, just laughing at the utter insanity that is Bloodlord. Number 7. Speaking of Gilded Pooh's conspiratorial smearing spree, he made another video just peddling even more conspiracies, this time involving Queen Seraphina in a supposed Discord raid before Sarah's server actually got raided with zoophilic and scat content. This was the same Discord server with minors in it. I don't blame Sarah that, that there are minors in the server at the time of the raid. It was something they couldn't prevent from happening anyway. Even Chambers of My Heart, someone with a history of having rape fantasies and victim blaming in defense of Gilded Pooh, attacked Seraphina for supposedly raiding his server before they raided Sarah's. By the time this video comes out, Gilded Pooh doesn't need any copium to demonstrate how much of a drama puffer he is. He's so unbelievably fucking full of himself he can't even reach his own dick at this point. 8. 
Kazbor Fox is still seething like a little girl on his server, as more and more people tend to distance themselves from him and his mafia on both YouTube and Discord. And to make things spicier, he decided to do this whole little announcement of I'm quitting predator hunting as a fucking hobby. You don't make that a hobby. Lyle Convoy is not perfect at his job either, because he now has a history of not just double-checking his friends until it's either somehow convenient or when all things go to shit. I'm not the first to acknowledge Lyle's idiotic decisions, alongside with some other cowards that call themselves quote-unquote victims or predator hunters that turn out to be troll shielders that sat on reporting Vita and other predators themselves whilst falsely accusing Serafina, Tom, and others for doing the same as a means of projection. I know he makes the stupidest decisions to give these victims the benefit of the doubt, first key included, but that is nowhere near the same as supposedly hiding evidence in defense of these predators. He's not that stupid, Gilded Pooh. Now is he? After this video, I'm going to go back to what I normally do on my main channel and other channels hereby. I've got some more great content in the works. That is all I have to say about this subject or topic surrounding the fallout of this drama. I'm Brian Mullins the Fox, signing out.